Hello, this is a tutorial about setting up skyboxes and image-based lighting in LightUp version 1.3. We have here a scene. Um, I'm going to just open preferences and I've set a skybox up but um, we're going to have ambient occlusion, exterior and just the normal blend which is just basically take the surface normal uh, and use the, sky, uh, the SketchUp background colour. So let's just click Tor Tool. Okay, there we have it. Um, that's just straight ambient occlusion, no direct lighting. And that's fine. The thing is, is that we, here we've got a skybox and um, the lighting from the ambient occlusion doesn't quite match with the uh, skybox. So one of the things in version 1.3 is that we can um, use image-based lighting um, blending. In other words, what we do is we do an ambient occlusion um, calculation and we treat the skybox as a, um, uh, a huge light source. So if I now click Tool Tool again, what we'll see is uh, lighting which uh, reflects the skybox that this, uh, this is in. So you get something that's very natural and, and uh, blends well with the, um, the surrounding skybox. If I change the skybox, so if I just change it to something different, um, I've changed the skybox and I press Tool Tool again, we'll get lighting that will be recalculated based on um, this skybox. And again, you can see the, the tone of the uh, result is, is quite different. Um, reflecting the fact that uh, the surrounding is quite different. Um, so you can use uh, six-face skyboxes or panoramas. You can use radiance files um, and it will honor the exponent of those. Um, so again, if I open um, uh, the preferences and just go to... Um, so if Take something like uh, this. This is a panorama file of an early morning uh, sunrise. And again, the ambient occlusion uh, changes to reflect that and fits in completely with it because it was generated from this uh, skybox. Um, you can open. Um, preferences and you can just see the lighting only or um, you can um, click to see uh, it with the textures. And there we have it.